there we go, we're live. So we are at the London Motor Show at the XL Centre. And oh my god, just check this out. There is going to be a video going up, uh, up on my channel, possibly tomorrow. Depends when I get home and edit it. But we're here now today anyway. And this place is absolutely manic. So that floor felt really weird. Car alarms going off everywhere. This, there are so many people here, you would not. What the? What? 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 <laughs> Just bumped into these people with like motors on their heads. That's bizarre. Right, okay, so we've got. Uh, F type? Yeah. <laughs> I had to think about it then. No, E type. E type. It's me time. And then I got a clip of this thing starting up. TVR, brand new Griffith. Which I actually really like. Uh, what else is here? Dove Customs is behind me, like over there. And they've got Supercars of London, Archie's car, Archie's old Corvette. What else they got over there? A couple of bikes. Um, some of their cars that they usually just have in the garage. This is quite nice, I like this. It's like a transit RT. That's super cool. What'd you say? Oh yeah, there's McLaren over there, we'll get to that. Um, but you guys may recognise this. This side. Oh, and actually I want to show you this Lois first. Well, I've just shown you that, but it's that in the background. I think it's like the world's, holds the world's fastest land speed record. Something like that, but anyway. And then this Lois. Very gorgeous, I love that. Um, what else? Morgan. Oh, there's a Eurus. Let's go see the Eurus. There's a Eurus over here. Pretty sure that holds the land speed record. Something like that, anyway. I ate road stuff. There. Lovely stuff. Oh, fly through people. So busy here, you would not believe. Yeah, you see mine? And then... Eurus over there, but this is cool. This Bentley. Portofino there. Let's go see the Portofino. Oh! It's walked into my camera. Portofino, what a stunner. Zorati <laughs> Levante S. Caitlin, you really liked the Levante, didn't you? Mm -hmm. So this is one of Caitlin's turn. This is one of Caitlin's favourite cars, this one. Uh, but this is a Levante S, so it's 3 litre V6, 430 horsepower. Woo! Right, anyway, 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 where we was actually going was to see this. Oh, yes. This is what we came here for. Look at them flakes. Oh, look at them flakes. Have a look inside, little peek. Ooh. Gorgeous interior. And then there's also, oh, just, I, can't, I keep getting attracted to that thing. Black badge. Very nice, I like that a lot. Uh, V12. Six litre V12. Oh, big engine, big things. Right, let's go towards um, should we go towards Dove Customs? Where should we go now? Oh, let me show the Aston. The Aston's pretty cool. I'm not a fan of red. If you guys don't know, I'm not a fan of red. But uh, yeah, let me show you. Let me show you this Aston Martin. It's got a really funny front grille. There you go. That's cool. Just kind of cool. It's the new Aston Martin Vantage. It says on this back. Hyper Red is the name, which is pretty cool. Nice tan interior, let me show you the tan interior. Yeah, I like that a lot. Uh, what else is there? I've got some big vans. Oh, there's a um, X, Jaguar XJ220 over here. Which I absolutely love. And a Veyron, which I think is it at this stand. Yeah, the Veyron, you're not going to see the Veyron. It's so many people. Jaguar XJ220. Gorgeous stuff. And then amongst the crowd over there, that's a Veyron. That's a stamp, by the way, in case you're wondering to get back in. Um, yeah, Veyron over there, which is cool. Uh, this is Liberty Walk. So there's 
Liberty Rock GT, Mustang GT even, and a, an Aventador. I can't see if it's an S from here, but I think it's green Aventador anyway. And then one of these things, I don't actually know what they're called. Emok, is that what it says? Yeah, Emok. Emok, Emok, whatever. I'd love to have one of them. Especially around London. Uh, what else is there? I don't got a quadrifolio here. I'm a big fan of white cars, so that's actually probably one of my favourites. Then, where else should we go? They've got a Formula One simulator, but I'm not really interested in that. Uh, but I've got their 182, is it called? I don't know what they're called, but I don't really do our baths. Kind of nice. The MX-5 chassis, all I know about it. <laughs> um, what else? Let's go over to Dub Customs. If you don't know Dub Customs, it's literally about five minutes from where I live, so I know these guys quite well. Big shout out to Dub Customs. You've got to check them out, they're awesome. So this is one of their TVRs that they have at Dub Customs. Um, this is not a wrap, this is paint, I do believe. I'm right in saying. Um, so in the middle there, we will we'll see it another time, is Archie's Lamborghini. Check out my video. Link will be in the description when this has gone up uh, the video anyway. Just there is Paul Wallace's uh, C63. And then behind that is Archie's old Corvette. And then there's a gold bike there, which is a YouTuber. I'm not 100% what his name is. And I believe these are Dub Customs 3. I think this one definitely, I'm not sure about that. I'm not 100% on the McLaren, but seeing all that for Auto Clim, also check out these guys. Auto Clim are awesome and I use all of their products. They've got a lot of stuff on, on sale there. Um, <coughs> where else should we go? It's so busy. Um, let's go this way. Oh, there's a, there's a company here and they do like. Um, kind of like um, unveiling machines. So the machine goes behind the car, turn around, these things, and it will pull the cover off this Ferrari all on its own. Really cool, so check out these guys, which is awesome. Um, and then, what else, what else, what else? Um, Those uh, exotic car collection, they've got a uh, big Bentley, a Lamborghini, Hurricane in green, which is gorgeous, I'll show you that in a second. Uh, and then they've got a white Aston Martin over there. Let me show you Clive's side, because these are mental. Oh, he's got underground neons, that went on earlier. Ford Raptor. Which is really nice, that thing is proper cool. Look at this. Caitlin, get that on camera, because I haven't shown that yet. Oh, that is so cool. That supercharger as well, that's awesome. I love these blue lights, that's cool. And then that underglowing neons down there. <coughs> um, and then over there, they've got a classic Mustang, which when we get through this crowd, we will go and have a look. Should we go through here and go see the Dodge? Oh, squeeze through people. It's Raptor, Raptor in satin black as well, which is really cool. Or is it matte black? It might be matte black actually. Whatever. Dodge something. Charger? Challenger? I'm not a big fan of Dodge. I don't know what this is. All I know is an SRT. It's the only thing I do know. Again, not a fan of roads. Caitlin, what do I say about red cars? They're horrible. Just not a fan of red. And it's not because I'm a Spurs fan. Genuinely not. I just don't do red cars. Oh, the engine bay. Woo! Check this out. Oh, supercharged Hemi Long. I love that. And then this thing next to me is a Lincoln. Something around. Oh, wait, look at this. Now that is luxury. That is cool. Now 
That's nice, I like that. Okay, so let's go back this way. Where's Caitlin gone? She's there. Oh, this thing's cool as well. Be able to have a cold. But it's really cool. They did have the boot open earlier. All I know is there's a flat screen TV on this wall. Someone's playing FIFA. But even up front, it's really nice quality in the front here as well. So the driver gets a nice drive while he's driving someone very rich, very expensive in there. See, he's got screens at both ends. You can all see what's going on. Which is super cool. So you can literally have like four player playing FIFA and everyone can see a screen. Screen this side, screen that side. I love it. That's cool. I think they're worth so much money. So then, let me show you the classic Mustang they've also got on the club, Sutton Stern. I did go to these guys last year. Oh, that was loud. And, uh, yeah, they didn't have anything. Anything like this. Ugh, squeeze through the people, sorry. What do you think of the classic Mustang? Isn't it gorgeous? Can't quite see it though, there's too many people. Is it a fastback? Yeah, I think it is. Just about. The side exit exhaust down there as well, that's cool. Nice leather seats, look at them, they're massive. Not much on the interior, but when you've got a car like this, don't suppose you're really going to need it. GT500. How beautiful is that? Okay, and then. Uh, did I show you? Oh, we'll come back to Top Customs because we're probably going to still be live streaming it anyway. Oh, yeah, that's psychedelic. This is a psychedelic wrapped car. That's cool. Look at this. Three M. Shout out Three M. Matte black or satin black doors, bonnets, just 3M wrapped in psychedelic on the arches there. That's pretty cool. I don't know what these are. Oh, it's milk chocolate. I'm not going to take it in case I'm not allowed, but that is so cool. I like it. That's funky, right. Then, what else we got? MG stand, anyone interested in MG? Toyota? Hyundai. Hyundai stand. New Holland tractors. <laughs> Shout out to New Holland. They're about five minutes away from my house as well. Which they're cool. The size of these things, they're massive. But yeah, New Holland. <laughs> and then, what, what even are these people? What even are you? I want to get past, guys. I'm sorry. Sorry, can I squeeze through? Sorry. If I can take pictures of Poxy. Oh! Jeep thing. Military stuff. Anyone nerd now about the military stuff at the minute? No idea what that is. Tractor. Another tractor by JCB this time. Which is cool. And then, what else they got? Ice cream man. Of course you've got to have an ice cream man at a motor show, haven't you? I mean, come on. Stop all the supercars. Mind that child. Just ice cream man. You, you can actually, this was open earlier. You could climb in it, which is cool, but... Yeah, Triumphs, they're always cool. Nice bikes. Um, my favourite's the black one. Caitlin loves bikes, so... Checking them out, aren't you? And then this isn't a Tesla stand, but... I mean, this is a Tesla. They're always cool to look at. My favourite one's the little one. What one? Oh, the little car on top. I didn't even see that. That's cool, but that looks like a Lexus, but it's clearly not. It is a Tesla. Oh, it's a smaller one of this. Oh, I've just realised. New Tesla. What is it? Oh, I can't read that from here. Oh, P90D. Oh, that's pretty cool. I like it. Anyway, then right over here is my favourite. 
So there's Jam Sport ST. Is it an ST? Yeah, that's an ST. Or is it an RS? <laughs> I don't actually know. But anyway, that's still nice. I think it's an RS. Yeah, it's an RS. And then, oh my god. My dream, the dream. I love it. I love it, I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. Super cool. Uh, and then over there is where people are watching the Royal Wedding. They've got another whole unit next door. And they'll be watching the Royal Wedding. <laughs> My words just weren't coming out. And then this is McLaren. And the queues are huge for McLaren. Just about to see it all. So that's a 720S. And then over there, I'm not sure what they all are. 570? 520? No idea. But McLaren's always cool. And then over here we've got Caterham. Oh, I'm trying to squeeze through these people. Just stood in the middle of a fucking crosswalk. Seriously. Caterham. Caterham, Caterham, Caterham. Just about to see him. Very nice, very nice. And then I pace. These, we, me and Caitlin sat in this. They're both very comfy. A little bit upright, but very comfy. That is a gorgeous colour. What a lovely colour that is. I love it. DB11, which I never actually came to see, actually. I saw it from a distance. That is cool. I like the DB11. Very nice. This one, this Aston Martin, was it a Vanquish? Or was it a Vantage? I can't remember. This has got a story. Definitely check out my uh, video in the description. Check that out because this car's got a proper story gotta have a look at the headlining in there i'm not gonna show it in this live stream but gotta check it out that car's got a story it's pretty cool and then eventually we're gonna get over to probably one of the coolest highlights of this place oh yeah we got we got a show we got a show the van <laughs> yeah shout out to fraser you better be watching this i gotta take a picture for you that's super cool. And then, American trucks, Hummers. Sorry for the shaky camera. Can't even get a phone out of my pocket. Oh, yeah, I've got to show you the AMG GTR. In that, whatever it is, like £7,500 op optional extra paint. It's something stupid like that, isn't it? If you've ever been to Mercedes-Benz World, you guys win. You've got to go here. Proper cool place. Do things like this, like an off road in the G Wagon experience, an off roading in, I think that's a GLS, I'm not sure about all these Mercedes models, but yeah, they're super cool. And then there's like a uh, uh, F1 car that's been taken apart, so you can see all the works and stuff. SLS, I love it, I love it, I love it. Mercedes Benz World is so cool, We've gotta go back. Um, but then over here, we are gonna go and have another look at these trucks. And I say another look, I mean another look. Where me and Caitlin have been here so many times. It's been in my video lots and lots and lots of times. Look at these trucks. Super cool. And then a Hummer. Hummer H6, I think it says on the plaque. It says H2 on the side, but it's definitely H6. Let me show you the plaque. Hummer H6 SUVT. Whatever that means, which I love the back of the Hummers, where it says Hummer across the back here. I don't know if you can pick that up because I can't see it, I'm shaking too much. But yeah, I love Hummers. I don't think I can show you the interior, I don't think the phone's going to pick it up. Massive seats, can you see? Not really, no. Massive padded seats in there. Oh, look, it's a wild cabin. And then this thing, this thing is just. Unbelievable. Look at the size of that thing. Whoa. Okay, and then everyone's queuing to get in the truck over here. Which is pretty cool. So, let's go back around the front. Let's wait for these people to take pictures. But let me show you this. Well, gorgeous. Welcome. It's got a welcome pack. That's so cool. And a 300 machine gun on top. That's so cool. The little hole in the top there I'd sit right here that's where I'd sit right there be like take me away I love it 
That's so cool. So then the fire engine that's over here, Caitlin got inside in the video, so you'll have to check that out as well. Really cool over there. There's an Impala. If any guys like the uh, classic American cars over here, this this Mini's cool. Classic Mini that someone's raised. Put some pretty sick tires on it. Oh yeah, here we go. Here's Caitlin's ride. I love that. <coughs> and then a Chevy Impala right here. Look how long this thing is. It goes on forever. Pinstriping paint on the back there. Gas Monkey Garage sticker, shout out. This car was recently purchased, will be restored. Blah, 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 blah. There you go. So. <laughs> it's really hurting my throat all this talking. Um, but, what else can I show you? Range Rover, there's a couple of last and stuff over there. Uh, where is it there? We go over there and show you them. On the top of people's heads. What else? And then that's pretty much a whole loop of the March show, I think. Sorry about my hand getting in the way, I'm trying to hold it. That drop in the camera. Uh, what else? What else? What else? What else? I think that's it. We've pretty much done anything, haven't we? There's the little highlights here and there, which I'm not going to show you because I've got a full I video going out anyway. Um, that's pretty much it. This Porsche's cold, this classic Porsche over here. Check out this. Again, I don't know Porsches. So is this an old, it says Tiger on, Tiger on the side there. Let's have a look at the plaque. What does the plaque say? Ren Sport Conversion. There you go. That is quite nice, I like that. Oh yeah, Bentayga. This is the Bentayga Hybrid. I have to read them before I say it because clueless. Oh yeah, can't want to count your favourite cars. I ate Roadster, so this is. They took out the rear seats, cut off the roof. Really cool looking. I actually quite like that. The only thing I've never liked about the i8 is the blue. The blue around the grills around the badge, the doors are still super cool. The doors still go up like you'd expect them to do on an i8, or that way it goes. And uh, blue seat belts, blue down the side here. And it's Roadster on the side there. Which is super cool. And then, whoa, this thing. <laughs> uh, what else, what else, what else? can I show you? I think that is pretty much it. That is the London Motor Show. And then in the middle, turn. Why, does, why do they make the buns so small? Let's go around here. Okay, we're going to go show them these. This Lotus, I love this colour. Gorgeous colour Lotus. And that transit van again that I showed you. Oh yeah. Noble M600. Completely forgot to show you this. This is green carbon fibre. They are so, so expensive. If I could turn the torch on and show you, I would. But it's in my video, you will be able to see the green carbon fiber. And then this thing. Rawr, size of that. Which is awesome. You see it straight through the middle? Ah, oh, they've got seats up. But it looks very expensive in there. Gonna get a bit close. Oh, that's a big queue. That's a big queue to get in this van. Jeez. Okay, and then there's a mini rally car here, which is pretty cool. That's awesome. Look at this. Oh, can is that? Sorry, walk straight into. This was the green Lamborghini I was talking about at the exotic car collection. Oh, green Hurricane. I love the interior on the Hurricane. That little Lambo badge in the middle there. So cool. Everything's green 
and then the Vanquish. Beautiful. Vanquish convertible, what a gorgeous car. Uh, let's go this way. Past the Prius to the Bentley. It's pretty cool, and then let's go actually over here because I don't think I've shown you these. We have a GT3, black and red, with Porsche across the swiller, which I really like. That's super cool, and these vents, these vents just make the car. Gorgeous car. And then, I think this is a 675 LT, in a flip colour, which is pretty cool. And then a GT3 RS over there, which also looks really nice. But this, I do like this. It's like Roaring Thunder, I think that's what the wrap's called. It's kind of what Paul Wallace had on his M3 before he wrapped it into like a Nardo Grey. Since M5 it is. Super cool car. And then over here we've got TBR, which I showed you the back of that one, I'm pretty sure. But then there was this one as well. It's also like a flip colour, which obviously you could get straight from TBR. Or back then you could get straight from TBR. I'm not sure if they still do it. And then the Griffith from the front there. I think that looks like an RX-8. What do you think? It's kind of similar, isn't it? Okay, and then that is pretty much the whole London Motor Show. It's pretty small. <clears throat> All this talking to my throat so much. Uh, MG3. And that kind of is the Motor Show, that is it. What else? There must be, I must be missing something. I feel like there's more. These people are so weird. That's always pretty cool. So, that is the London Motor Show. Let me go over to Dub Customs to say goodbye. But, uh, yeah, that is it. We'll show you Archie's old Corvette. We'll show you when I can squeeze through the big one. Some people just don't get out to walk. Archie's old Corvette, Paul Wallace's C63, Archie's current gold, uh, gold chrome? Black chrome Lamborghini, and then some of the Dub Customs cars, which I showed you previously. So. London Motor Show. We'll see you guys in the video, which should uh, should go up tomorrow. And uh, hopefully, I've shown you everything I need to show you. Oh yeah, Liberty Walk GTR. Got to show you this. Liberty Walk GTR as well. But that is the Motor Show, and I guess just check out the link in the description to the video, which should be going live by the time you've seen this. I believe. I'm not sure. Oh, and I'll show you the way one as well because that's the other car I didn't show you place is manic. Gorgeous Bugatti favour on. It's a shame it's in red. What a shame. But there you go. That sums up. That sums up the London Motor Show. That is a lot. And uh, see you guys in the video tomorrow at 6pm. See you guys and take care. Peace.